Well, it's very hard to battle cultural expectations. Um, if a cultural expectation is that news should be free, then you try and charge money, it's tough. In terms of the future of the industry, I think every outlet is going to have to take one of three or four strategies. They're going to have to adopt some kind of elite strategy whereby they say we're going to produce excellent journalism at the very high end, the kind of stuff you cannot just find in Google News or Yahoo News, and we're going to put a lot of resources behind it. But to do that, the only way that's profitable is if you're not giving it away for free. If these magazines, these newspapers are going to survive, you can't have that going on. You're going to have to have more aggressive legal methods of making sure the content stays behind pay-to-view sites. Otherwise, the elite media outlets simply are just not going to exist anymore. The only way you can make the situation work is using traditional marketing methods, convincing people they are getting uh, a elite, some kind of elite service, some kind of elite uh, news source that this is something that is beneficial to people who are professionals, who are executives, who work in knowledge industries, catering to their sense of who they are, to their needs as professionals. You know, you have to use conventional marketing techniques. This is how you get people to pay extra money for gourmet food or for organic food products uh, or for elite education. They respond well when you present a good as being an elite good as being a luxury good, as something that is not accessible to everybody. In terms of the mass media, um, they're going to have to survive on advertising. Um, so you're going to get sort of middle market newspapers, or what used to be called newspapers, but will essentially become local media aggregators on, on, on the web, uh, and transmitting local media stories to cell phones, and Blackberries, and other kinds of devices. Um, they are going to have to rely on um, on advertising because the sort of information that they're giving people is fairly generic. The only way they're going to be able to make money is if you, they attract millions of people to their website and then get lots of advertising. Regional media are going to do very well. I think radio is going to continue to do really well. Uh, people are going to continue to drive cars. They want some semblance of local community and a local radio station provides a little smidgen of that.